The Colonial Pin 995 plan, is it a scam or is it legit? We're gonna be breaking down that exact question and also showing you how much coverage you actually get for 995 and even showing you maybe a better option that you should be looking at when it comes to life insurance. My name is Tim Shooker. I own a company called Zoosurance. We help seniors get the top quality variant insurance for the lowest possible price. And I'm about to be breaking down this 995 Colonial Pin plan for you. So stay tuned for the rest of this video. The first thing that I want to touch on is you've probably seen this TV commercial here. Mm -hmm. You've probably seen this TV commercial here. We got yeah, Jonathan right, Lawson the colonial. basically talking about Colonial Pin, the three P's, price, price, and price. So what does this actually mean? What is this actually talking about, right? As you can see, the price you can, af price you can afford, the price that can increase, and the price that fits into your budget, and coverage options start at 995. Now, this is the important thing to note here is that the coverage options start at 995, but that doesn't mean that it costs 995. Right here, you can see you can buy more uh, premium based on coverage options you select and coverage amounts uh, coverage amounts based on age and gender. So it actually varies based off of your age and gender. As you can see, there's just all this other stuff that goes. Let's see if they have fine print at the end of the commercial here. Boom. Da, 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 da. Total coverage. Okay, cool. So this kind of gives us our basic gist. You guys have probably seen this commercial before. You know, the 995, whatever. Call now and get the free gift. You guys have heard it, right? Um, let's look at Colonial Pen's website and let's kind of break down what you actually get when you get this insurance. So as you can see, again, coverage options starting at 995 a month. Here's something that we need to pay attention to is where it says guaranteed acceptance life insurance. So what does guaranteed acceptance actually mean? Well, that means that you can get accepted no matter what your health is, right? So you could have been diagnosed with cancer or you could be running freaking marathons. It does not matter. You're going to be able to get approved. Now, the thing is, the person who's running marathons and the person with cancer pay the same price, meaning that if you have any, like, if you're not the most unhealthy person in the world, you're paying more than you have to, right? So let's also look at some of the terms. We're just going to pick a random state. I'll do Arizona here because that's where I'm based out of. And uh, as you can see here, there's no health questions to answer and no physicals to take when purchasing this plan. We've already kind of discussed the downsides of that. We can guarantee your acceptance because of a two-year limited benefit period for death from non-accidental causes, which means if you die in the first two years, your family is only going to get what you paid into the policy. As you can see right here, the beneficiary will receive the premiums paid plus 7% interest compounded annually, meaning that you're basically just getting a 7% interest savings account, not a life insurance policy for the first two years. Now, why is this a bad thing for people that can get day one? Well, a lot of a lot of you watching this are healthy enough to get day one coverage, meaning that as soon as you pay your first premium payment, you're covered immediately. So if anything happens to you, your family will get that full face amount, right? And a lot of times, the reason that people are getting this type of life insurance is to cover a funeral or cover other final expenses and final bills. And if something happens to you in the first two years, which maybe you're saying, you know, I'm not going to die in the first two years. I'm healthy. I'm going to live to 90. I'm going to live to 100. Well, the thing is, like, you never actually really know. Anything can happen at any time. And it's important that your policy covers you as soon as possible if you can qualify for that. So that's one thing a lot of people don't know about the Colonial Pin Plan is, um, that it takes two years to actually take effect, even if you're like as healthy as a horse. So I wanted to touch on that there. Now let's actually talk about what you can actually get for 90, for 995. And so I've compiled the rate chart and this is basically, so 995 is per unit of coverage, right? So you may be saying what, what on earth is a unit of coverage? That's just complete, you know, crap speak. They're just making this up and you're hundred percent right. So 995 gets you one unit of coverage. Now the unit depends, like what is one unit? Well, it depends on if you're a male or a female and it depends on your age. So I have the whole rate chart here. This is if you're a male who's in his 50s, one unit is 1,669 in coverage. If you're a female who's in her 50s, it's 2,000, right? Males are always gonna pay more for life insurance. It's just, we get the short end of the stick because we die sooner. Um, but as you can see, the rates go up and up and up, and the amount of coverage you get for 995 goes down, right? So you may be saying, okay, you know, at this point, I'm like a little confused what 995 gets me. Basically, one, like 
one unit, 995, if you're a 50 year old male, gets you 1,669. If you're an 80 year old female, it gets you $608 in coverage. You may be saying like, I'm trying to cover a funeral. I need like $10,000 in coverage. Eight, $608 is not gonna be enough. And that's my whole point. 995 usually doesn't get you the amount of coverage that you need, right? So the other thing too you have to take into account is that you can only buy up to 12 units. So basically, let's say you're a 70 year old female, you're gonna pay 12 times 995, which comes out to $119.40, which is basically 120 bucks. So you're gonna pay $120 for $1,000 in coverage, or for $12,000 in coverage which is the max that you can get. So you can only get up to $12,000 in coverage if you're a 70 year old female. And again, whatever 12 times one unit of coverage is, is the most amount you can get. So realistically, it's gonna be really tough for you to get the amount of coverage that you want with this company, Colonial Pen, because you can only get up to 12 units. And also, the rates are so much more expensive because they're offering it to everyone. And you have that two year wait. So. My recommendation for most people that are looking for life insurance is to get a different type of policy, one where you are gonna have some health questions, not a medical exam, but at least be asked some questions over the phone. That way you can get matched with the company that's gonna give you the best options. And for most people, Colonial Pen is just not that. So if you're looking for a life insurance policy that's gonna cover you from day one and also is gonna give you the most amount of coverage you can get for the lowest possible price, my company's insurance shops all of the top insurance companies to find you the best rate that you can possibly get and get the most amount of coverage for you and your family. So if you want to learn more about that, uh, click the link down below. We have a form you can fill out uh, to get pre-approved and learn about your options. If not, I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I will see you in the next one. Take care.